So what you do is you get a nice sized dollop on the end of your spatula and you plop it on your cupcake and pat it around a little bit so it's nice and smooth around the edges. And then start from over here and you go all the way around and back the other way. And then you sprinkle it. So you're getting a dollop, right? It's all smooth and happy, and you're aiming for the middle, and you just start patting. You're just homogenizing it. You're making it look round. And then you make a ridge all the way around. And you bring it back the other way and pull up at the exact same time, and you get the swirl. That looks so easy. <laughs> Give it a shot. That could be a really good one right here. Cupcake, and you kind of cradle it in your hand, and you grab a nice rounded little dollop, right? You're going to aim straight for the cake in the middle, and you just start patting it. All you're doing is you're lifting it up so that it creates a rounded shape, right? So all we're doing is we're making a little ridge. You kind of at an angle with your knife, and you go all the way around, 360, right? As soon as you reach that seam, you go the other way, and you lift up at the exact same time you get the split. So go ahead and give it a shot. You are doing this great so far. But the whole point is to have fun. So it doesn't matter what they look like, they're still going to taste just as good. So we're getting that ridge in there. We go all the way around. See? My knife is slightly angled. And I'm just twisting the cake, so it's creating that ridge. And you go all the way around again. 